Hey peeps, what's up? I got another muffler. <laughs> it's like the third one now. I had this on my uh, D17. I loved it. It's kind of funny. It shipped like and it's an original box. The last time I got it, I didn't get it in a box like this. But uh, I'm doing this with one hand. Got myself a dual dip for the EP3. It's still too loud. Construction is a lot better. It's way heavier. There's more insulation in it. I'm going to take this bubble wrap off the best I can without killing anybody. It's written vibrant there. You know, it's not a knockoff there as well. Nice and solid. It's a heavy, good feel. Two and a half inch. I'm going to weld that up. Maybe tomorrow if it's nice out, the weather lets me. I'm sick of the sound of it right now. It really sounds like a fucking can. Because that's what's on there. An empty can as a muffler. So, that's my quick little unbox of that. We got Logan's homework here. He's not doing that right now. He's helping me with some dishes. We got the summer tires there ready to rock on the Odyssey. Tomorrow it's going in the garage at 1 o'clock. New summer tires. There's a flange on the exhaust that needs to be fixed. And uh, I'm going to have them check the engine and transmission mounts. They feel a little soft. So I got two more bags over there. I'm going to grab and come over here. But until then, I will be back. All right. I'm going to do the best I can to unbag this because uh, I'm doing it one-handed. I lost my camera woman today. She's at the hospital with uh, Alex. Oh yeah, this. This is really cool, man. Shake and break. Look this tool up, man. Anything that's a Phillips head, will, this thing will knock loose. And it's just a wonderful tool to have in your, in your bag of tricks, as I call it. I think that's all that's in there. That was about 60 bucks. What is this? What is this? Oh yeah! I got my flush kit. Flush and fill kit. Pretty good. I gotta flush the CRV and flush the EP3 and uh, maybe flush the Odyssey too. I got, I got quite a lot of flushing to do so I figured I'd pick up myself up a kit to help me with the job. So that's it. My shake and break. My vibrant dual tip and my Prestone flush and fill kit. All right, guys, I'll catch you later. Hey, peeps, what's up? We got two packages today. We got the kids in the background. No school. We got a nice storm. Dad, Dad, the ball. Oh, what is that? That's a crushed box. <laughs> <laughs> Got Jake the Snake filming for me. <laughs> it's uh, obviously another accessory for the Spark. Yo. It is. Oh, it's a sunshade that goes on the uh, gimbal and the drone so it doesn't get glare from the sun because the camera the way it acts if the sun is directly on it it will it will tune it out kind of but if it's a glare from the side it's really shitty quality so this is cool I got that it's been a while I've been waiting for that but it's in is it going to be another crushed box I hope not I know what this is and I hope it's not crushed Oh! Eakin. Eakin. HR9. This is the new 4K. H9R. Uh, H9R. What did I say? HR9. <laughs> <laughs> Dyslexic kicking in. It's a new model because it has the round lens 
and it's not written Wi-Fi under it, so it's a new model. Um, 4K. 4K, but I'm going to be doing 1080p at 60 frames a second because that's what I upload with. Oh, there's a little crunchy going on there. Okay, one second, Ryan. I'm trying to make a video, though. If it's not an emergency, I'll be with you in two minutes. I didn't even cut it. It just stuck back on. Oh, God, there goes the package. <laughs> oh. There's your GoPro. Isn't that the GoPro you were watching a whole bunch of videos? Yeah. Alright, popcorn's ready, guys. I'll put you on pause and I'll be back. Okay. So they uh, they included a uh, an adapter for a US plug because there was like Australian and Europe. I don't even think Australian has a different style plug, but I'm just making shit up right now. But <laughs> European style. Here I went and got the drone. I'm not even sure how this fits really. A mirror check. Doesn't look like it fits, peeps. There's like a clip here, but I got nothing to clip it on. I don't think it goes. It goes like that. That's awesome. Someone knock at the door. All the weight I'm putting on that drone, it's not gonna fly very long. I'm gonna go see what who knocked. All right, go see who knocked. We're filming. It. Uh huh. A prank knocks all the time here. Yeah. Hey, Dad. Someone does prank all the time. No, look, I'm so Alex. Look, I'm and so it's this guy I'm behind the camera. <laughs> Got the instruction <laughs> manual. So I think so I think that might that Nice new USB charging cord. A strap of some sort. I like the box. They, you know, you pop your finger in to pull it out. Another zip tie and strap of some sort. I got a few mounts here, which is really cool. Basic mount, like a handlebar mount, if you want to call it that. A screwy thingy. A screwy thingy. <laughs> uh, looks like a to mount it up to. Yeah, another base to mount it up like this. Just pan over here. It slides in, and you can screw that pin in. I actually got a few of those. Got a. This looks like a tripod mount, which is really cool. Looks like a case for it that goes kind of around. There. Another. Another back case. A back case. Yeah. A wireless uh, controller. Two more flat mounts. And that's about it in that box. A little thing. It's a little piece of plastic. But, uh. Man, this thing's pretty stiff. I think you gotta lift the plastic up and then pull it out. The plastic kind of locks it into place because it's harder to squish. Yeah, exactly. So. This is the physical camera, which is really cool. That's pretty small. Concentration. Whoops, I just shut it off, I think. No memory card, but you guys get the idea. It's a real widescreen. Widescreen camera, looking through a widescreen camera. Alright guys, so we'll do some tests with this. And, uh... 
I will definitely get back to you. Uh, I'm so stoked. I have two spare batteries for it. I have an SD card already I bought. And something really cool. I'll go grab it real quick. Put it on pause, but I'll be back. Yep. You filming? Yep. So I picked this up. It's a it's a mount, and at the same time, it has a 4,000 mAh battery capacity. Uh, I don't know how many hours this is gonna give me, but oh, it doesn't. It doesn't. The phone, the camera doesn't use the battery directly off this. This will charge the battery that's in the camera. So it's always charging. Yeah, if you miss battery, you just plug it in. And it's always charging, and so it's, it's good like, to vlog because I'm gonna start using the GoPro to vlog. And now that I found a good source seller on uh, on eBay for um, the Is GoPro, is it a pretty good weight too? No, it's not heavy at all. Oh, it's pretty light. You got the charging here and the wrist strap. And don't really think I need to see the instructions. It's pretty straightforward. There's a lead on it, I guess it was saying. Oh, you can mount it on a tripod. That's really cool. Like, maybe I do need to look at the instructions. Yeah. Oh, okay, the lead light's under here. Oh, it needs to be charged. It's completely dead. I hope it's on the lithium ion. No, it's an MAH. Lithium uh, ion, if it completely dies, it's dead. If it's a one cell. Alright, so that's pretty much my, my setup right now for, uh, for the GoPro. Well, the GoPro action camera. But uh, let's get set it up. Let's get it set up. My god, I can't speak. And uh, we'll try some uh, little action shots for you guys. Catch you later.